What's up everyone? Welcome back to my channel. It is currently Sunday right now and we are having a relaxing start to the morning. We woke up, we ran to stop and shop, get a few things, and now Vinny's studying a little bit and I'm going to take advantage of the fact that Beasley, our dog, is at Grandpa's for the weekend. Get a little bit of an early start to spring cleaning, you know? So on Friday, we're actually having Sam Brew and Monica come over because Sam wanted to do my makeup. Monica wants to do like a couples in home shoot, which I'm completely on board for considering we just got our house this past year it hasn't even been a year yet so yeah i want to try and make it look as clean as possible in here so we can get some really nice professional pictures if you are new here my name is abby i do a lot of videos on home decor routines day in the lives i do hair so i do a lot of videos with that a lot of the videos include my husband and my dog so if you are interested in seeing more content just like this please make sure to hit that red subscribe button down below so today there's two things i really really am excited to do so we got these couches from West Elm back in October. I haven't fluffed them yet, so excuse their appearance. That's the one thing is I do feel like they start to look a little like deflated after a little bit. So once a week, I like to really like wipe them down and fluff them. But honestly, I think they just really need a really good airing out. One of the reasons I liked them and wanted to buy them is because they all are zippered in. So I'm going to take off all of the covers and wash them. I'm kind of nervous just because God forbid they shrink or something. That would be super unfortunate, but I think it'll make them just like come back to life a little bit and I wouldn't want to try and do this while Beasley's here if you are new here <laughs> that is her dog so I don't want to try and do this while she was here because she loves the couches and I don't mind her being on the couch I know some people don't like their dogs or animals on the couches or the beds that is fine that's not how I am it's her house it's more her couch than mine if she was here she would be like rubbing her hairy body all over the hoverless couch and I just don't want to risk that another thing I'm a little embarrassed to even show so this is our rug it is my favorite rug ever and I try and keep up with it as much as possible basically the color isn't even what it looks like if you could see over here we tried to like spot clean a stain and I think that was the old color I didn't realize how bad it was until I tried to move the couches and underneath the couches it is basically pure white we are going to run to Home Depot a little bit later and I want to get could rent like a rug doctor carpet cleaner but the good news is is I think it's close to 50 degrees out today so I want to open up all the windows and turn off the heat and really get some fresh air in here. It'd be cool if you could completely just change the color of your couch. Now it's blank. I realized after like thinking that, that that wouldn't be possible because this doesn't come off like the outline, but if it could, that'd be really smart because I feel like I love this color, but if I didn't have a dog, I would definitely have like that white cream. I would totally invest in even something like the cloud or something if I knew that one, it completely covered any type of like dog damage. And two, if you could like change the color of it whenever you wanted, like just buy the couch cushions to interchange, that would be so cool. All the cushions are airing out, so let's throw these covers in the wash and pray that is going to not mess them up or shrink them. So I think this is kind of risky putting all of this in one load, but I put in heavier loads before, so I'm sure it's fine. So I'm going to use the detergent, put a little bit of that in there, and then I think what I read to do, it's delicate, 
cold water. Start. Be good. And everything also obviously said, do not put it in the dryer, just let it air dry. And a lot of things actually said to put them on the cushions when they're a little bit damp. So I'm just gonna fluff these guys. But honestly, I'm getting tired, so let's make some coffee. I wanted to try like a shaken, I don't know, when I used to work at Starbucks, there was this drink that a lot of people I feel like don't know about. It was called the double shot over ice, which means two, but there was actually like five shots in there. And you'd pour five shots of espresso and then put it in like a tea shaker, like a cocktail shaker, and you would shake it up with ice and like syrup. So I kind of want to do a variation of that, except to like a big coffee. We have like an espresso pod that's called like the Alto something, and it's like a big, big cup with two shots of espresso, and I want to shake it up with some of our Starbucks creamer that we love. And as you can see, I'm constantly patient saying all the time. Nobody told me to settle down. Day nights and late nights don't get around. But there's something about you, something about you I like, about you I like. You're crazy for saying I should slow down But maybe I'm escaping the love we found There's something about you Something about you I like About you I like I get too drunk and too scared and It spills all over I know We're messes Why not? The way that I am <laughs> That's what it looks you puddle. Nobody loves me better. Nobody loves me better. Nobody loves me better. Yes, I'm just too scared to settle down. That be many nights. What the original color was? I mean, that's what Why? That looks lighter than this. I know. Oh, it's so it's soft. Oh. Uh, no, I don't know. Oh, that, no, that's that's what it is. <laughs> this is the part that the couch No, this is what got. I don't know. No, that looks pretty disgusting. Easily rolls around. Yeah, look, you can literally see, like, right here. Gray. Brown. Steam clean Beasley. Oh. Okay, so off we go. We are going to go get the rug vacuum because he said that there's two left, but we can't reserve them. So I'd rather get that in the car first and then we will go get some lunch. I'm gonna go old with someone that loves my soul and I wanna share everything I own. Share a family, share a home. That's all I know. Thoughts again and again and again. It's like. The goods, we got the goods. It looks like little R2D2. It is. I had sangria. Food was amazing, but we sat next to two of the most absolutely insane people. I don't think we talked the whole entire time because we were just staring at each other <laughs> with our mouths on the floor. It's what I imagine conversations <laughs> in like San Francisco or like LA. Oh my God. I, like the first thing when they sat down, she's like, have you been cupping Jeremo? <laughs> <laughs> and she was talking, she's like, oh, I want steak, but I can always have steak tomorrow. And I don't know, because the steak's gonna ground me. She started panicking when she got the steak and eggs because it was making her body feel cold instead of warm. But she got <laughs> warm water because cold water, what'd she say, it uh, enhances. And the waitress comes over and she says, so she goes like, that waitress is great. She's so focused. I goes, yeah, she is great. She goes, well, she's not that great. She was like, she's not that great, Jeremy. And everyone, i.e. me and Vinny, just looked at each other like, holy shit. Now we're getting liquor because I'm on Greyhounds. Someone did you wrong I can see it in your eyes It's like your fire is gone Across your face It is written across your face If you wanna talk I'm right here not gonna leave your side Just feel free to open up When the moment's right Across your face 
It definitely made a huge difference and he has his greyhound and that one's looking really good me and Vinny have been watching love is blind because our couch just looks so far away as you get married for longer and longer your couches get further that's Abby this is blind <laughs> we get really into shows like cheer on Netflix bachelor we get super into shows like this but we used to like the bachelor we haven't watched a full season remember the Jojo Fletcher season remember Chad or Jordan the crazy guy yeah like that's when we liked it. Like we liked like crazy OG Bachelor, but we haven't actually watched a full season. Isn't crazy OG Bachelor like 1999? Alright, so we watched like <laughs> mid-modern century Bachelor. So we've been watching Love is Blind and we cannot be the only one that thinks that this bitch is crazy. I hate her! Oh god, she is the freaking worst! She is just horrible! What's his name? Adam? <laughs> <laughs> Every person I've just made up a name. <laughs> you do that in real life. She's like, I saw Barnett, and all I could think is that he's very troubled looking. Like, no, that's you. Is Amber her name? The Tank Girl? Yeah. yeah. Barnett and Tank Girl look like they've been having a blast. Why would you say Amber? Is that her name? When I say, yeah, Tank, uh, tank Girl, you can say yes. Tank Girl? Why would you just say your name again? Mm hmm. Fair enough. Yeah, well, <laughs> but yeah, this show is great. We started watching it like a day or two ago and we're on episode five and every episode comes we out. We started watching it last night. Did we? <laughs> <laughs> Waiting for the rug to dry. Pretty successful Sunday. We went to Stop and Shop. You studied, washed couch cushions. We watched a really awkward couple fight at the diner. Uh, we'll probably check in in a little bit. We are going to yell at Jessica some more via the TV. Good morning, guys. It is the next morning. Uh, we ended up just staying up later than probably should have. I am going to head off to work, but I figured this is a perfect chance to show you the rug. It did lighten up so much. Whatever, it still looks better. Couches look better, so later tonight we'll probably throw the couches back on the rugs that basically does it for today's video i hope that you guys enjoyed i want to do a lot more just like vlog style videos so i hope you guys enjoyed and if there's anything else that you guys would like to see please make sure you let me know down below and i will see you guys next time bye